गुड मॉर्निंग नमस्कार फ्रेंड्स वी आर अगेन हियर फॉर द नीट बायोलॉजी क्लास एंड आवर टारगेट नीट 2021 एंड दिस इज द एनिमल क्लासिफिकेशन टुडे नाउ वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द इन वर्टिब्रेट्स वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस इन वर्टिब्रेट्स नाउ इन अ वर्टिब्रेट्स वी शैल डिस्कस अबाउट साइक्लोस्टोमाटा इन पीसेस टुडे इज टॉपिक इज पीस पीसेस फिशेस एक्चुअली द फिशेस हैव अ Two different, two different types. Uh, one is osteichthys and is chondichthys. We know that vertebrates is divided into two parts. One is agnatha, another is nathostomata. Agnatha, that is having no jaws. Am among the having no jaws, they are cyclostomata. So first we will discuss about cyclostomata having no jaws. Later we will discuss about osteichthys and chondichthys, that is pieces. pieces are the part of nathostomata that is among the craniata they are the ones so now we will discuss about cyclostomata cyclo means round stomata round mouth they have round mouth as well as they have a lots of teeth around the mouth and have a suckeral mouth suckeral they have suck and they are ectoparasite and absorb blood so let's start what are the traits of cyclostomata cyclostomata are sanguine sanguinivorous that is blood lovers they are ectoparasite and ectoparasite on whom exoparasite on larger fishes they attach themselves on the surface of a larger fish and they absorb the blood huh, as their food so they are the ectoparasite and examples of teromyzon lamprey and hackfish these two examples are very important lamprey hackfish dogfish later we will see that in chondrichthys there is a dogfish so teromyzon is a lamprey and uh, the common name lamprey and hackfish is a mixin hmm. cyclostomes are actually the eel like long structure their body their skin is so soft and they don't have any scales we will see scales in osteichthys as well as in chondrichthys in chondrichthys we will see placoid in osteichthys scaloid and uh, ganoid Hmm, tinoid these two types of uh, three types of scales are there placoid ganoid and tinoid but no is no scales is present on cyclostomes cyclostomes are totally scaleless now uh, they have a kidney prominent kidney they have notochord cyclostomes are vertebrates cyclostomes among the acraniata uh, they have a, um, a vertebrates but as they have a vertebrate the vertebrae actually uh, uh, but normally all vertebrates contain the notochord notochord is replaced by the uh, spinal spines the spines replace the notochord but in this case notochord is present throughout the life in case of osteichthys we will see the notochord will be reduced but in this case notochord is present throughout the life so this is a hallmark trait of cyclostomes Notochord is present. Notochord throughout the life. Notochord is present throughout the life. Imperfect vertebrae. Vertebrae is present, but not perfect vertebrae. So this is important. Habit. The C and oh, their habit is very interesting. They are all extremely uh, exclusively marine, but in their life cycle, during the um, period of uh, reproduction, they go to the river and they are they may go to the river and they are they are laying their eggs and uh, sperms. and then they die and after dying the baby will go to the hmm, metamorphosis automatically they go to the uh, they undergo metamorphosis and after undergoing metamorphosis they move to the again the same source of sea from where their parents came so this is very important that this is this special trait that is known as genetic imprinting this genetic imprinting trait is very important that is and larva is amo amo larva is amocyte larva larva is amocyte larva this one is very important their fertilization is always external fertilization their fertilization external fertilization they don't have such a uh, internal fertilization they have external fertilization they 8 to 10 pairs of cranial nerves they have normally 12 pairs of nerve but now cranial nerves would be there in case of uh, birds mammals in reptiles not in birds mammals and reptiles see 12 pairs of cranial nerves cranial nerves are the nerves that either re, uh, release from the cranium that is the brain directly or indirectly 
these are called uh, cranial lumps. So they have a eight to ten pairs of cranial lumps, five to six, sixteen pairs of gills, hmm. and most important, they have the cyclostomes have two pairs of uh, two, two two chambered heart. That is one art one article uh, one atrium one ventricle one atrium and one ventricle and they uh, the fresh blood and carbon dioxide containing blood are mixed together when the fresh blood and carbon dioxide containing blood mix together and uh, heart only pump the car uh, carbon dioxide containing blood so this is very important they have a sinus venosus they are external chamber in their heart but no cones are used this is very important they have a rbc red blood cells with nucleus they have a rbc with nucleus hmm. only in mammals you will see that the rbc is present without nucleus but in this case rbc with nucleus larvae undergo metamorphosis i have mentioned their skins are very important skins contain no scales cyclostomes skins have no scales and they have special unicellular glands of slimes so slime or mucus is released by the unicellular mucus glands ah. these are the overall cyclostomes so cyclostomes are the eel like body example lamprey had fish hmm. so this is a, a overall structure of cyclostome now we will see that what are the traits of amocyte larva is most important in this case and lamprey and hatch is most important as well as uh, these are traits however the chondrichthys chondrichthys the pieces are again divided into two parts ostichthys and chondrichthys Among the nathostomata, nathostomata is divided into two parts. Nathostomata, they have a jaw or jawless. So jawless, here the jawless cyclostomes. Here the jaw, hmm? jaw having divided again into two part. One is ostichthys and another is chondrichthys. So ostichthys and chondrichthys is most important among the jaw animals. Ostichthys. Uh, here the chondrichthys. Chondrichthys is actually the cartilage containing animal. Feces among the feces of two part. One is cartilage containing, another is bone containing. That is, exoskeleton is either cartilage made or bone made. Here the chondrichthys are cartilage made. Chondrias means cartilage. Most important hallmark trait we will discuss here. That is, they have ventral mouth, not a protruding mouth. They have ventral mouth, as in shark. We see that if shark has a ventral mouth, that is, if there is a, if if the body is like that, if the body of shark is that, then this is ventral mouth. This is a ventral yeah. ventral mouth. They have a clasper, their reproductive organ. In case of males, male have a special reproductive organ. This is now clasper, and the scales. They have a scales as well as the mucus gland. The scale is known as placoid. This is called placoid scale. And rectal gland is present as a salt regulation. This is most important trend at present. We will see it is rectal gland present in many organisms in future. In digestive system, uh, the uh, chondrichthys have a among the shark is a model organism, and chondrichthys has scroll valve and spiral valve. What are the scroll valve? Their digestive system is folded, scroll, uh, or folded in spirally so that the absorption surface will be increased. to increase the absorption surface the digestive uh, uh, digestive uh, system is scroll no this is very important they have a gills but having no operculum like the ostichthys that is bone containing feces have their other outer operculum so that the gills are covered but in this case gills are open uh, liver gives buoyancy no swim bladder is present so their liver contain oil that oil uh, or fat substance Will gives the buoyancy. We know that the fat, sub, uh, fat actually uh, it buoys in nature. Uh, fat helps to buoys them. One important is then they have the ureotelic. Ureotelic. Ureo is there. Urea is there. Uh, excretory organ. The most important thing is they are ovoviviparous. That is that they lay eggs. Internal fertilization occur. Now external fertilization occur. They lay eggs inside the female body. And eggs has inside the female body, and after hatching, the baby uh, comes through the cloaca uh, from the female body. This is ovoviviparous. Uh, we have already seen ovoviviparous in arthropods. Hmm. In case of the scorpion, they are poikilothermic. That is, they are not able to contain. They are not able to maintain their body temperature. They are cold-blooded and not able to maintain their body temperature. So, body temperature is changed. That's a poikilothermic. 
10 pairs of cranial nerves is there in a cyclostoma there are 8 to 10 pairs here the 10 pairs uh, from the avis mammalia and uh, reptiles will see the 12 pairs of cranial nerves lateral line of organ they have a lateral line of organ in that way lateral line this lateral line is converted muscles and having the special character of uh, the sense the electric magnetic field generated by the other animals so this is very important electromagnetic field is uh, recepted by this hmm, particular organism particular uh, line so this is very important uh, lateral lines of organs is present example is scoliodon dogfish dogfish is the name dogfish we will see in different exams dogfish torpedo electric ray tigon stingray stingray is very dangerous and uh, it is a poisonous and chimera is a rabbit fish of rabbit fish or ghost fish rabbit or ghost fish is chimera is name you have to remember this and write you have to take note rbc is with nucleus we know that rbc will present in a, with nucleus through, uh, up to the mammals and inside, uh, just before the mammals up to the uh, abyss hmm. mammalia uh, having no mammalia in some mammals they have a uh, new uh, nucleus hmm. but in uh, not all mammals they have a cloaca as they are uh, excretory uh, as well as in as for childbirth for reproduction hmm. for cloaca in case of males they have a clasper uh, reduced notochord they have a notochord but with reduced content so these are the um, feces among the feces they have a cyclostomes having agnatha uh, and they among the nathostomata they have a jaw among the jaw have a feces first jaw organism is feces then we'll uh, see the different other organisms so nathostomata having the jaws and uh, among the feces these are the one breakfast so we will uh, give it uh, the all the traits in uh, pdf format in description so you will uh, take note properly